Yep, back out again, second night, ditched stalker, fed up with him like, oh, with Tom Ua. <laughs> Wayne's back, Wayne's back in town. After about a year. Alright, doing a while. So we're going up here, which is probably the steepest path in the Lake District, if not the world. Yep, sheep are skitzy. We're going up there. It's called Lawn Scale Fell, I think. Another northern fell we're going to take off. Good views over Derwent. It's not far to walk, but look how steep it is. Ooh, I'm not looking forward to this. Anyway, we'll crack on. Forecast is dry tonight with uh, light winds and then tomorrow like through the night the rain's meant to come so I brought my tent tonight albeit it's just that pyramid tent I'm going to be wishing I'd brought the solo but uh, we'll be alright oh I'm not looking forward to this still feel delicate off yesterday how are you finding how are you finding the, the walk? It's steep it is isn't it? short steep. but steep if you look back to my head, you'll see what about, it is. Just about to turn around and see how steep it actually is. We've come off the main track, but God, we came right from down there. The car park's there. Yeah, Up the side. Take my time, ah, there's no rush, but uh, whew, look at the views. It's actually all about the views. He's not here, is he? Ha! Dumped him. Staying pretty clear as well. Yeah. Ah, it looks alright. So we're going up there anyway. This is Lawn Scale Fell. Is it Lawn Scale, eh? Lawn Scale, I think, eh? I don't know. I get mixed up with that the other one. Longlands. Longlands is a tiny little one. But yeah, we're just going to press on. We're nearly, we're nearly there, to be fair, like. Um, that hump, then you just take a right. I'll let you scan on, I'll do me a little bit. Well, we've made it. 2,330 feet. That's Lawn Scale Fell. Down there in the trees, probably not be able to see it, is Skiddo House. That's um, Great Calver, right in front of her. All these northern fells that we've climbed, all these. I can't remember, I can't remember which is which. We've got Skiddo up there. Skiddo little man. I think that's the path we'll take when we go, we're gonna camp on them two at some point. And we'll go up that path, because that, albeit it was steep, it wasn't very long enough. But look at the top, it's flat. It's really flat. Great. Good views over there. Nice. Need a good flat pitch for that uh, tent I've brought. It's got to be flat, otherwise it doesn't go up very well. Wayne's got a pre-tent tent as well, so we'll have a look at that. It's different to mine. I have to look at it. Hey, hey, oi! Come back, get back here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, sheep worrying. Now's my reputation. I reckon it's good. Yeah. I like it. Aye. Right. Got the views over there. Right, Johnny, <laughs> Look at that. Derwent water. Keswick and that. Oh, named all them last time. Anyway. Right. Do it. We'll do it. Alright, set up. It's gone up well again. I've got the, the fly door open. So I can cook in behind that. Not that it's breezy like. Probably didn't need it, but it's all right anyway. Happy with it. Mark's in his Viso. Disco tent. Disco tent deluxe. Ah, uh, someone's got to carry a disco tent. Yeah. Every time. You're the uh, pit pony. The pit, the pit pony. And Wayne's in another pretense job. It's called the Ridge Monkey or the Ridge Line. Don't film me, I've got chocolate all in my face. Ah, yes. <laughs> Done. <laughs> chocolate face. Just had a muffin. Oh, I see it. Big massive black for his gato on his bag. 
That's a good view, isn't it? Oh, through there. Shave it on a heat wave. It might have been a bit much. But I could be a little bit warm. It's cold, isn't it? For like mm, it's chillier than I expected. It's supposed to warm up again, though, after. Yeah. Hopefully. After the camp. <laughs> oh, he wants to finish camping. Yeah. Yeah, so I'm going to go down shortly and get some water. There's a little, I think a little puddle there. It's big enough, it's got enough water in it to, to filter. Just for boiling some water, like, I'm not going to drink it. And that's it. We're all set up. going to crack a beer open soon. It's nearly time. I'm just having having a wayfair meal now. It's raining, so I'm in. I'm in my little shelter. The rain's on. That wasn't in the forecast. Bruce Forsyth on. A few of the beers over there. It's too wet. Because the rain's off anyway. It rained before. I had to shut that. Oh, it's nice over there, look at that. It's that nice, it's that nice sort of calm, weird sort of light. It's really nice. They're talking about caravans. And they've got the sun going down at back here. When you think it was raining about an hour ago, mad. Lake district for you. We're in the tent. Anybody thinks it looks like an una? Look at this man, for a view. It's absolutely spot on. Oh, I'll just hold it there so you can have a look at that. Nice. All the cloud on the tops. Nice, we're just drinking beer, talking rubbish. I found a love and hate. Never had one of them for ages. Actually had one last night, but before that, ages. Oh, it's cold. It's really, really chilly. We're all just down jackets and we're all still cold. Oh, yeah, that's a nice picture. Eventually I might get one, but I think I'll just we're just, for a while. So we're just uh, watching the sun setting behind Skidor. I've got some nice photographs of that, like, look at that for a picture. Picture perfect, isn't it? It's yeah. lovely. Red sky. When it was raining, like, an hour ago, we thought we we're going to be tent bound. Forecast dull as well, eh? Ah, it is. It was. This was, none of this was forecast. We just had a rainbow over here before. You can just barely make it out. It's where it's faded. Trouble is when you see a rainbow, it means there's rain somewhere. <laughs> That's it. Oh, so we're in the uh, disco tent of terror. There's no music. There's no music. No. There's no internet, so we can't get music. No. It's old, neat. old school entertainment. Uh, right, it's old school entertainment. We're telling jokes. We're telling jokes and they were having japes. Arnie's best joke was um, how much did your pretense cost you, Arnie? It didn't cost us an out. How much are they new? 375 quid. And how much did I pay? 150. Aye. Don't, so, all, don't do what I've done and order one when you're drunk. Drunk. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> So anyway, Mark, have you had a good night tonight, or mm. what? Yeah. Have you? I'm just finishing the night off with a... Um, Nine percenter. With a coaster roaster. Is that your last one? Oh, it is, I. Evil Twin versus Brew Dog. You've got your finger out with a percentage. Sorry. I'm, I'm, I apologise unreservedly. Nine percent. That's no. mad, that For you, that's ridiculous. It you is, shouldn't it is. That, like. I just have to. You can't have a drink like that. I've got a, um eye cut. And if you if you spell it backward, it's taxi. 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 That's not, is it? No, no. it's not. Uh, no. Uh, <laughs> yeah. You messed that one up. I really have. I really have. Eight percent. I think I've had too much. 
I've got my black current drink there. Yeah. What have you got, Wayne? Oh. Just smash and grab. Smash, smash and, and grab. grab. It's a Morrison special. Which is 8%. By the way. <coughs> Excuse me. So have you had a good night, Wayne? Have you had a good trip? It's been good. All the way from Hull, you know. It's He's been... Uh, dedicated, this lad. It's turned out better than expected with the weather, like. It's so. just a shame me and him were here. <laughs> <laughs> He's come all the way from Hull, this fella. How it's, long, not, it's not that far. How long does it take you? Two and a half hours. Well, so a, the a bit longer long because of delays and that. Two and a half hours? Is that all it takes? To two and three quarter because of the delays. But I would have thought it was a lot longer than that, would you? Mm. I'm surprised at that. Thing. Anyway, yeah, so... It's a small country you now. What we're it's not do, a big country you now. What we're going to do tomorrow? Go home. Before that... How long does it take you? About two hours. Well, that spoons? Well, that much longer than it. It depends on the traffic. Well, that spoons for breakfast. Where the spoons for breakfast? Aye. Oh, oh, I could eat that now. No, mm, so that. Good. And a pint of brew dog. Oh, no. no I've done a bit of that, right? <laughs> eight, <laughs> eight o'clock. Nine o'clock in the morning. Pint of brew dog, please. <laughs> Boosh. Oh, I'm not driving, so I can. No, you can't, I? I won't, though. I'll be, no, get, I'll be no, getting no. coffee, for sure. Aye, so anyway. Not much happening, need crack like the froze. It was all full of japes and songs before. Now I'll put the camera on and it's right, froze. So it's, I've, um, I've, I've worn down. Froze. Right, so we'll say good night. Sleep tight. And don't watch let, watch the bugs don't bite. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Mm-hmm. Or the ticks. Or the earwigs. Or the spiders. So, sorry, <laughs> sorry we, me and Wayne have got permethrin on. Or the spiders. We've got the permethrin on. Wayne's terrified of uh, hunt, huntsman spiders. What are they? The, uh, the Lake District. Uh, what are they called? The, um, harvestmen. Harvestmen spiders. Whatever they are. Terrified of them. Daddy long legs. Uh, Any kind of spider, really. So basically, the most harmless spider aye, in the in world. world aye, aye, aye. Aye. Right, that's it then. Had enough. Bored. Bored of these two. I'm going to Morning. Morning, come as high. Nothing now. Zero zip zilch. Not a thing. Zero. Nothing. Nout. <coughs> oh, COVID. Ah, blimey. What a night. Oh, what a night. Late August. 1963. Oh, I'm absolutely knackered. It's 10 past 9 in the morning. We're just waking up. I'm not putting the camera on it because I look like death. Actual death. So it's uh, rained overnight. It just kept coming on and going off and coming on. Mad weather, like. I'm gonna get up and have a, um, a cup of a cup of coffee. I'm gonna have one of these um, special coffee. They're on special offer at Morrison's at the minute. Two pound for a box of six, I think. Nice, like normally three pound fifty. Get them while you can. Ooh, <sighs> cranky. I'm still tired. Put the waterproofs on. And then make like a tree and get out of here. That's it. That's literally it. And just uh, looking at the, the vestibule or the porch. If you if you're normal. It's massive. Look at this porch area, here's a huge. I think last time I had it in Achieve it, I didn't have the um I didn't have it pegged. I don't think I pegged it there. I brought I had to peg further back. Oh, so it was really small. But when you when you do it properly, it's massive the porch like. There's just so many spiders up here. Wayne doesn't like spiders. I don't. Aye. 
Ah, oh, poor old spiders. What's he killing them? Oh, there's loads. There's two up there. There's another one. There's still one there. Look. Come down. Come down. It's absolutely everywhere. But we don't want we don't want to take them home. We don't want to come and live where I live. They're better living in the lake district than Gant the Blag. Look, there's another one there outside. Right, that's it. Look at the weather though. <laughs> it's gone it's gone tits. It's gone a bit peat. Wayne's packed his lightweight bag with all his heavyweight gear in the lightweight bag. <laughs> Mark's packed with his 110 litre Keza. Right. And I've got a 48 litre bag, look at that. Everything goes in that little bag. It's as light as a feather. I'm the lightweight camper like. I really am. You drank all your beer. Drank all my beer. And I've got a little dry patch. That's all I leave. I might leave the odd tent peg like, but I don't think I don't think I have this time. I have in the past. And then Wayne's just left a patch of grass. Put my rain jacket on. Yeah, we've all got our raincoats on the rain's Mizzling. Look at that, that's a perfect little patch in it. <laughs> <laughs> perfect little spider field. Oh, the spiders are terrible. Seen how many of those? There's millions of them. Me mental. There's one there, no, yeah. there's two there. How's that one? There's a gang of them. There's millions of spiders. Never seen anything like it. And we don't want to take them back to Blythe and Hull, so we're trying to get them off with tents as best we can. Was, eh? He's off, he's filming. Well, we've come down the descent of absolute terror. That is so steep. There's loads of people going up on bikes, for God's sake. Can you believe? Any thoughts, Mark, of the camp? Oh, I was was quite good. Yep. The only thing I would change was I would just as at about 11 o'clock <laughs> instead of half past 12. <laughs> half past 12. <laughs> but apart from that, it was kind of high. Apart from it being like, I must be able to get, get me out of here with them spiders. Yeah, the spider challenge. <laughs> I've never seen as many in my life. The spider oh, challenge was accepted. <laughs> There was, there was all the spiders. If you haven't got any spiders in your house, that's because they were up there. Right. That's where they live. <laughs> right, so we'll see you on the next one. Uh, thanks for watching. Sub, subs up, thumbscribe, like and share. Duh.